I have been a special procedures tech for nine years. A special procedures technologist is uh, someone who works in basically interventional radiology. The majority of the work that we do back there is patients with vascular disease. We normally work in legs. We get a diabetic patients, patients that are long-term smokers, um, who have bad flow into their legs. We open up vessels to get people relief from pain, trying to preserve limbs. Any calling we get is a, an emergency um, of some nature, and they're all a little dramatic in their own right. Usually if we get called in, it's for what we term a cold leg, someone who's lost blood flow acutely to their leg for whatever a clot is formed or something. And they're usually in a lot of pain, anxiety, you know, they don't know what's going on. And we go in there and do the best we can to, to fix the situation. And I would say a very high percentage in the high 90s, we usually save that and you know, get them back out of the hospital in a couple of days and back to a normal life. It's something that's very traumatic, you know, to a patient, and not the norm for them. I had a unique experience myself a couple of years ago where the tables were turned. I was diagnosed with cancer in uh, 2008 and uh, I had to have surgery twice. I, it was very different for me. I'd you'd normally been a pretty healthy person my whole life. I hadn't really had to go through registration and sit in a waiting room, you know, for my name to be called and, and go through that. So since I've done that, I think it helped me become better at my job, especially dealing with the patients, because I have first-hand knowledge of what they experienced. I enjoy what I do, the interaction with the patients, being able to honestly, you know, people say oh, we like to help people, but, but we do on almost a daily basis. We, we change people's lives, and uh, I, I, I just enjoy coming in. It's great. Everybody should have a job like that.